Hey guys, we're back with some more Dragon Age. My name's Rowan. Dragon Age 2, by the way. Uh, my name's Rowan. And uh, in our last episode, we cleaned up the rest of the streets, the docks, and low town of thugs and gangs and murderers, rapists, thieves, all sorts of low life scum. Anyway, now that the uh, streets are clean, we're going to go about doing some of our more main quests type stuff. Speaking of, let's see what we got. Hey, that looks like a gift we can give to... Yep, we have a gift, the Book of Chartan that we found at the Alienage, where we can give that to Fenris. We can go to Ariani and Lowtown. We've got a bunch of side quests here. Underground Railroad. Forbidden Knowledge is one that we kind of do over time, because those, those, those little uh, books, um, blood magic books that we destroy and we have to make sure that when we do this uh what's her name meryl's not in our party she she loses uh like 10 10 approval every time you destroy one of those books because she's a filthy blood mage she's a cute filthy blood mage but <laughs> let's see search kirkwall for more assassins hunting sketch I don't think we've been in Dark Town for this yet either. Dark, Dark, Town, Dark Town during the day. I think we should go to the docks during the daytime to talk to Mr. Selby. See if we can help some mages. Daytime docks. Selby's over there. Black Tower, courtesy. Let's talk to this guy. Get the quest. You are Hawk. A patrol went missing along the wounded coast. You have fought Kunari before and triumphed. Arvarad, no less. So tell me, did you kill them? I can't be your only suspect. There's Coterie. Carter, Templars, take your pick. <clears throat> you think the Baas in this city could fell a Karatom? Hardly. You are another matter. If you are not responsible, I waste my time here. Find out what happened to a Canary patrol that went missing along the wounded coast. Okay. I'll have to do that one too. You sure you don't want a little extra for your retirement fund? That stopped with Jevon, as did your extra shipments. Ooh. <laughs> don't mess with Aveline. Um, and I have. Make her turn his gaze on you, child. Dating merchandise. Just did you get anything new? Oh yeah, there we go. Barrick and Fenris now have a rune slot. Nice, nice. Look at us, we're up to 171. Maybe we can get that uh that ring from uh the underground passage guy. I forget what his name is already. Shitty Tom. I'm just kidding. Uh, I think that's another game. It's a guy named Shifty Tom. I used to play Elder Scrolls Online with my family. Uh, I still do from time to time. But there's a character named Shifty Tom, and when I first saw it, I thought it said Shitty Tom. I I called him that, and that kind of stuck. Now that's what we all call him, Shitty Tom. All right, Mistress Selby. Uh, one sec, guys. All right, here we go. What do you need, love? Package delivery. You look like my mother. I got a letter from some mage friends. 
I see, I see. Check the back of the board for our special rates. Helping apostates is dangerous. If the Templars caught you... One of my sisters is a mage. A gentle child, so generous. She was made tranquil last year. Templars claim she was a danger. Now... It's like she's not there. That shouldn't be forced on anyone. Oh, cloak and dagger phrases. How about the queasy crow flies at midnight? How about the smart mouth <laughs> gets slapped across the face? The board has all the details. Should you take care of something, just drop by. Search and rescue, and how to frame a Templar. Search and rescue. Starkhaven sent another caravan of mages bound for the gallows two months back. I think those who help rescue are comrades. Now one of my brothers has been apprehended by bounty hunters. I offer a goodly sum of gold to anyone who can go to the wounded coast and rescue him. At some point, the freedom of every mage is owed to someone, a sympathetic cousin, a kindly farmer, or a Ferelden refugee. They help because it's right, and we must band together again. Terry of Starkhaven. Yes, I accept. We must free the mages. <laughs> In the past fortnight, seven apostates have been captured because of one Templar, Sir Conrad Vernhart. I think that name is a play off of one of the other characters in one of their other games. Conrad Werner, <laughs> who's kind of an annoying ass in one of the other, in uh, the Mass Effect trilogy. He shows up in like all three games. It is never wise to underestimate a Templar's intelligence, but Sir Conrad is both brilliant and ruthless. We must remove this threat. Killing him is not an option. He must be disgraced, removed from Kirkwall, and ideally cast out of the Templar Order. Fortunately for us, the Templars na now fear they've been infiltrated by a blood mage's puppets. Of the several Templars who are watching their own, one, one is deep in the throes of Lyrium and can be fooled. His name is Sir Roderick, and he frequents the Hanged Man. His testimony alone will be dubious, so we must search the gallows in Lowtown for any slight of fa or fabrication that can defame Sir Conrad before we all fall. Hey, free loop. Squirrel! I think they did a good job of portraying this, uh, like the atmosphere of a city like this. This place looks like it was built by slaves, like a sad, sad people. Subjugation, it, it like reeks of subjugation. The whole, the whole atmosphere, the whole city. Looking to hire solid labor. Getting tired of the dogs myself. Beats the mines, that much I know. Good work. I can't, how come I can't run that fast? They didn't want the people to be to be able to beat this game quickly, so they made us made us run slower. turn in our little side quest there some dude and looking to collect the old god Dumat artifacts seems suspect to me kind of like a 
a guy buying Nazi paraphernalia in, uh, in the real life. Do Dalish honestly not recognize the difference between demons and beneficial spirits? We've never thought of the Fade as the home of our gods. It is another realm, another people's home, no different or more foreign than, say, Ozama. But have you never studied the types of demons? They break down very clearly into different sins. Spirits differ from each other, just as you and Hawk and Isabella are all human, more or less. Not exactly, as we learn in the next game, but there is definitely some truth to that. Nothing to report, Captain. Good. Carry on. Check your purse. I think you lost something. Alright, so let's go do those two quests that we picked up. The Lost Patrol and Search and Rescue, both on the Wounded Coast. Canari must like it here, to stay so long. From what I've seen, the Canari don't like anything. That can't be true. They must like some things. Sunshine? Butterflies? Rainbows? If I spot a Canari admiring butterflies, Meryl, you'll be the first <laughs> person I tell. <laughs> uh... enemies down here, huh? Unexpected. Oh, thought I crashed for a second. Ah, thanks, the shitty dagger. remember this being here. Might as well. Let's do it. Spontaneous. Yeah, I gotta do it now, because we'll forget to come back. I don't remember this part of the game. Maybe there's something new. Spiders? Who could have guessed in a cave?
but I did took I did check out Lord of the Rings online. Um, it's free, so it doesn't hurt anything. I created a character. Oh, did you hear that? That sounded like a dragon. <laughs> I'm excited. Uh, yeah, so I created a character, and you know it's funny. For such an old game, my computer uh, can only get about 42 FPS on max graphics on that game. That feels wrong to me. And my computer's not horrible. It's not great. It's not horrible. What is this? Oh, shit. No, we gotta come back. We can't have Matt Merrill in our party for this. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to come back to this place. Yeah, those forbidden tomes we have to destroy, and Meryl loses approval when you destroy them. She she loses like ten approval for each book, and there's like four or five of them or something. So, yeah, can't have that. We'll come back. I mean, it's a dragon. We have to have to come back for a dragon. Uh. What in the hell? That's so weird, man. The dogs just came out of nowhere, and we've already been up here. Whatever, whatever. That's what I mean about this game, they just kind of have enemies appearing out of nowhere for no apparent reason. I think my weapons for these are, yep, wrong, definitely wrong. Demons. Humans. Spirit damage. I think that fire damage they're not immune to. And he's got demons. Okay. Kunari patrol was killed. Report this to the Kunari in the low town docks before nightfall. Got some raiders down here.
Help the guards assault the raider base. Guards? Those guards. Alright, here we go. Lieutenant Harley? Aveline? Thank the Maker. I take it you know each other. Harley is one of the Guard, recently promoted. This disaster has my first routine assignment. I happen to be in the area. Seeing the sights, killing bandits, the usual. Not the best time for jest. Bollocks. <laughs> We're up against Evett's Marauders. You're certain about that? Sell Auden's up there, and Victor Longdeath's handiwork you've already seen. We tried two sorties up the path, but it's trapped to oblivion. Now I'd be thankful just to get out of here alive. No fair, God Dog! You brought friends! Shut your mouth! <laughs> One sec, guys. Okay. Let's investigate. Fell Orden, Victor Longdeath, what are you talking about? They've been robbing and raping for Maker knows how long. Did a broad daylight assault on the keep to rescue one of their number two years back. Fell Orden, a blood mage, is here. Victor Longdeath, Sophie. Maker, you certainly drew a fine first detail. <laughs> Jeez. Isn't it suicide to stay pinned down here? We're pinned down right now, but so are they. If we run, Everett's Marauders escape again. So we've been waiting for reinforcements. Victor's arrows and Auden's fireballs taking their toll. But we can still take them down. All right, so since Aveline is with us, we can't refuse. And also, we want to encourage, encourage her guards not discourage them so we can't tell them to stay put while we take care of this we have to kind of have let them help us so let's do that the longer we wait the more of us they'll kill let's attack now i'm with you but my men may be too rattled to join us get as many of them as you can and let's go men we're taking the battle to them Look out for traps. Be careful. Everett's Marauders are deadly. I'm deadlier. Or we're deadlier. <laughs> I don't like the looks of this. Alright, so we got some traps here. That should do it. Okay, we could go around here. They've got people up here. They've got people up here. Let me see if we can... Nope. So no matter what, it's just basically going to pull everybody. Hold tight! Think you're going, Aveline? Hold 
set. There we go. Alright, everybody attack. Dispel, you've got to spell. Oh, shit, Aveline's dead. All right, that's your cue, buddy. This isn't doing the there we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. Right. That was actually kind of rough, man. That should be the last of them. They're all dead. I. I can't believe it. I'll tell Lieutenant Jalen at the keep what you've done. I'll make sure he rewards you. Good work yourself, Lieutenant. Make sure the others know it. Men, we're heading home. Nice. Pack, mana, enemies drop more coin. And Aveline has a rune slide. Woohoo! Nice. Done. Still traps. <laughs> I don't like the looks of this. More traps. That should do it. Free XP, that's what I call it. Free XP. Sure we didn't miss anything over here either. Hey look. More. Back our bow. Those poor canary. I think we got a solid group, guys. Solid group indeed. And something way to hell back here. Of course it did. Oh, 
I almost forgot the chest. <laughs> this is what Aveline almost got assassinated for? Rune of Defense. Nice. Wait, I thought we already had that. Maybe we don't. Now we go up the path where the Alva shop were before. Wonder what's up here now. I think there's a merchant up here. Oh, there's still Talva shop. Great. And that guy. Oh shit. Oh, we're going this way. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, I was a little worried about that that Sarah boss. Those things are powerful, man. You know what's kind of frustrating is that uh, dispel ability. I'm really not finding a whole lot of use for it. I don't even know if, if it worked right when I did use it. I haven't had good experiences with wilderness. Arlet's blush? The hell was that? There goes the merchant. There is a merchant up here. You are in a strange place, Ferelden. Speak for yourself. Tell me about it. You're up here with it the frickin' Kunari. And it need not be wholly unprofitable, provided few questions are asked. 
I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> Each point of health provides an additional 25% mana. Plus 30 cold damage. Actually does cold damage. It has 6 magic and 50, 40 mana and 40 mana recovery rate. That is a good... Very good staff. So buy this character. Defense. Jeez. Very good. little on the overpowered side though to be honest we'll have to come back to it hold on guys all right into the cavern we go let's remind ourselves of the question that we're on real quick quest search and rescue So we're going after the bounty hunter that kidnaps some escaped mages, basically. Or an escaped mage. They said brother. So it's a brother of someone. And they happen to be a mage. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, shit. Traps. It's fine. It's fine. Are you standing in the poison? Uh. Dude, I told you to get out of the damn poison.
How about you resurrect her? Jeez. That didn't look quite like I. I have no idea if that's going to do anything. I don't think it did. Yeah, it didn't do shit. Spell. Useless spell. I don't like that we kind of scraped by that one. I feel I'm not very satisfied with that fight. All right, we're good. Quickly, before more guards come. Terry said she'd find a way to rescue me. I will never forget this. Well, at least we didn't have to go far. Now we need to go and trade out Meryl for somebody else. Thinking, hmm, thinking Varric. So we can go do that Forbidden Tome. Kind of weird. I thought I heard a hissing sound up here as we ran by it. I guess we could technically turn in a couple quests while we're here. Lieutenant Harley said I should see you about a reward. That's it. Not even going to mention your scuffle with Evitt's marauders. Killing the whole lot of them. They killed a lot of good people. They won't kill anyone else, thanks to you. There's one small rub, though. Their leader, Evitz, wasn't there, was he? I don't think so. They weren't wearing name tags. <laughs> Evitz is the worst of the lot. He may try to get revenge one day. 
He can wait his turn. I won't lose any sleep over it. Maybe nothing will come of it. Thanks again for your help. Not for sure. Maybe Aveline's maxed out for approval. Yeah, that's why she didn't. That's why she didn't gain any approval from that. I think she was supposed to gain approval from it. All right, let's see here. Switch out Meryl. We'll get Barrett. He probably got a level too. Yeah, I think a lot. Of, I think all of them probably got levels. I need to level them all up. Damn, he got two levels. Start going in here. We're gonna start going in, in this tree. Eight hundred. Eight hundred percent for staggered targets. Good lord. And it twenty times force. <laughs> Holy crap. Well, we could at least increase his attack speed by another 20% and his crit damage by another 30%. Sheesh. This is a really good tree, man. Or at least it seems that way to me. I'm not a math, magi uh, math magician. <laughs> math magician. Abracadabra. Alright, let's uh, get the other. Let's get the levels and everybody here. Yep. You too. We're gonna actually use this. I think I'm gonna add this into the stun is gonna be good. That's gonna be some free crowd control. But this, I think what I'll use this is is a, a taunt if Anders or our healer, whoever our healer is, is being attacked. We can actually add that into her tactics. Enemy attacking Anders. Usability. Across the bow. We'll put that right up there with. Right up there underneath Evade.
actually, I kind of feel like giving her enemy enemy attacking Amber, uh, Anders. She'll attack anybody attacking Anders, I think. We'll do that first. Over any target of Aveline. So if anybody attacks Anders, she'll taunt them and kill them. And they'll have a minus 50% defense buff too, so that'll be useful, I think. Alright, let's switch her out now. And put in... Put you in. Give you your levels. You probably have like three or four of them by now. Nope, just two. <laughs> I'm wrong. He's got good defense. Magic resistance and stun chance. Might control, turn the blade, or elemental aegis. Can he get all of those? He can, right? Turn the blade. Elemental Aegis. Troll. Might. Gets this low, use second wind. Otherwise, this. Taunts. Any rally. I think we're good there. I don't remember seeing rally. I'll have to keep a lookout uh, for rally if it makes sure it actually pops back up. Him and we'll get Varric back in here. Alright, let's go tackle that dragon and destroy the book. I'm gonna grab a soda. Here. You, Varric, have a very large mouth. <laughs> and here I've always looked up to you. What is it now? There were fist fights in the barracks over who was the model for your guard cereal. Hard in Hightown. Riveting stuff. Everyone loves a dirty guard on the edge. Varric. Fine. I'll start his big finish. Three chapters until Don and Brenakovic retires and opens a tavern on the coast. 
I sure hope he makes it. He's getting too old for this shit. <laughs> yeah, Varric actually kind of uh, writes novels. Mystery novels and such. It's over here, I think. We didn't go this way, did we? Let's make sure we didn't... Le yeah, we lost. Left loot. Game. How's our inventory? Half full, we're good. Plenty of room. And we could sell it when we get back to the town. Back to the city, rather. Yep, look at that. Kill him. Got him. Nice. With all's favor. Ooh. Revives fallen nearby allies who have fallen in battle. And I could use that. Any of us could use that. It's like a grenade. That is awesome. Part way, part way there. Might as well keep going. Uh. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm not actually a rude, like in person. <laughs> I just am. I just, I'm just rude on the internet. I guess I'm a little bit of a troll, too. There we go. The Dank Cave. Bark spawn. Aveline first. Oh, that's right. We already killed all the monsters in this area. Now we gotta go up here. Here goes. Varric. I'm practically there. Seems to be 
unhealthy. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Sorry, Varric. Or Anders. <laughs> Degenerate essence. <laughs> what does that mean? All right, here we go. I think we have to fight another one of those uh, demon groups too. Yeah, we got a revenant. We got some abominations. For an abominations uh, and corpses. Okay, maybe this game's gonna start getting a little harder. Because there's some times where, like, Anders almost got one shot there, man. Where's my dog going? Dude, there's, like, some weird bugs in this game, man. <laughs> poor, poor Bark's fun. He's all de walking away dejectedly. Where you going, buddy? See something interesting over here? <laughs> He's just... He's just running away. It's so weird. Guess he found a squirrel or something. He's chasing after it. Alright. Bartrand when I find him. Any suggestions? I wish I got any of that. I didn't get any of that because I'm retarded and I cannot do more than one thing at a time. Let's double check up in this area, see if anything else spawns now. Probably not, though. Nope. Not a, not a thing. Meryl's home. Hey, girl, what's up? All right, so we're just over an hour, so good spot to stop until we 
uh, continue on in the next episode. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please like and subscribe, and maybe send me a comment or two. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good night.